Hi, I'm Naomi with the Naomi Butler Show, and I'm going to show you today how I use a pit pen to sign the back of my paintings. And I use the one that has the B, if you can see the B, because that's for bold. There's fine, there's medium, there's bold, but I use bold for the back of the painting. Now, I had dated it on the date that I was through. I have my certificate up top, and I'm gonna kind of get out of the picture and show you what I do. I have a certificate at the top that has all this information, but if that certificate somehow came off, then I wanna make sure that I write everything here and sign my painting with this pit pen. And so I'm going to put all the same information, the name of the painting, and as you can see, even the B for bold, it could be bolder, but this is energy number one, and it is a 60, Make that a little bit bigger, that would be perfect. 60 inches <laughs> by 48 inches. And I always put the GWC, which means gallery wrapped canvas. And then I'll put the words original. Acrylic. On canvas I have it already dated and I'm gonna put my catalog number which is 22320 and then I'm gonna sign it So there you go. It's got all the same information that's on the certificate in case the certificate ever disappears. And I'm gonna bring it up and show you the certificate that I have up top. And then now, you see my shadowed image here. I'm gonna take the phone out of here. Hopefully I don't cut it off. And go close up and show you how I did this. So I've got energy number one. I'm gonna back it up a little bit so you can see the size, original acrylic on canvas, the catalog number, and my signature. Then I have the date right there. So I hope you have enjoyed this and I am going to show you how to paint the sides. I think I already have varnish. I've got all kinds of other videos that I'm going to post, but I just wanted to show you how to use the pit pen. It is awesome to use for signing the back of the paintings, and this one is a Farber Castell brand. So, hope that helps. It really, if you're using a pit pen on a really tiny painting, then I would use the fine it works where you're signing and writing all the information in a small area. The bold works for a big canvas like this. And so it just depends on what size canvas that you're using. Hope it helps. I'll see you on the next one. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe to my YouTube channel, The Naomi Butler Show, and ring the notification bell to be notified of new videos that I publish. And... I will keep giving you some cool information. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.